Good morning, my friend. Today, I got a 2002 Chevy 3 500 V8 Silverado for 6.6 liter. It's a Chevy 3500 motor diesel. Uh, this time, I want to show you we started to replace the power exchange pressure line. This line comes to the hydraulic leak. To, sorry, <laughs> to the hydraulic power booster. Goes to the power steering gear box. Okay, the first thing is uh, for remove this line, we need to be take the driver side front wheel off. Okay. Well, anyway, you know, if put the jacket stand on the on the car, take the wheel off, and then we remove the cover. They got plastic cover for the for the dash, for the water, everything. When you take the plastic cover, what's on the fender? Plastic cover fender, and you see more room for remove this line. Okay. And then you need to be removed the the hose comes to the air cooler, goes to the turbo, okay? This is just I got a two clamps, one on the air cooler, another on the line goes to the turbo, because it's for the cool of the air. It's this, this engine is turbo diesel. They got a line, air line, cool off pressure line, okay? Okay, we continue. This is the line was broke. Okay, let me show you. Okay, I removed the the hose, the after cooler hose. It's the aluminum pipe. Just uh, we use it uh, eight millimeter socket for get loose the clamps, and we remove the clamps, and then we remove the pipe. Okay, when you got the pipe off, I want to show you, you got plenty, plenty room for take the line off. Okay, this line, you see this is completely broke. They come from the brake boosters. Okay, and then I want to show you, look, let me put a, let me put a cell phone. Okay, okay, you seen it? The gearbox, the steering power steering gearbox. Okay, this is the line. So you got plenty room for put the range. I think the one is 18. Okay, this is how we started remove the line and then we put a new one, okay? Okay, we'll continue. I uh, wanna show you, I take the line off after take the after cooler pipe uh, we take the line off to got plenty of room for get the the screw okay i got the line off this time i want to show you this is the after cooler pipe we take it just i got a two clamps and then this is the the power chain line power chain pressure line okay they got some curves on the line we need to be by exactly like this, the same thing, because it will have no room for do anything, bending, nothing. It's just exactly like it is. Well, I uh, will go to the auto parts. I'll go get a new one. Okay, I got a new one right now. Okay, it's exactly like I, that old one. The same thing for the same car, for the power steering pressure line exactly hose I will put it back on the truck the first thing is putting the power chain gear first and then you put it on the brake booster and before in the back the kind two little bit or rings put in the each point the line they got whole canal for put our ring you put put our ring and then tight 
when it's tied okay I want to show you the lines on the on the place exactly like a wool one plenty room for put it back okay this is the next step is put it back the after cooler pipe okay we put it after cooler pipe back they got a two clamps one on the top side one on the bottom is the pressure clamps use it a eight millimeter socket for tight and then you put it back the fender cover plastic they got some screw use it a phillips screwdriver for tight and put the wheel back and then fill it up the power steering fluid on the on the pump and crank it and blear the system just to turn the wheel left side the right side for like three four minutes and then we take the bowel off and check the level and see if need fill it up if not don't okay my friend this is sorry don't forget to share this video and put a like uh subscribe my channel for continue helping the people make some videos on live videos this video is nothing editing is like a live videos in the row okay the car be broken go fix it this is what i do it like that so it's not it's not like I stay in another place okay my friends this is the real videos that fix it the cars like it is you can do it like that thanks my friends